Hello everyone, welcome back. I hope you're doing absolutely fantastic. I know I am. And today we're back with another Microsoft Flight Simulator video. And this one will be on the G3000 Enhanced Mod. I will have a link in my description down below, so if you enjoy this, make sure to check it out. Also, leave a like and subscribe, it helps me out a lot. It also lets me know you guys are enjoying the content. And again, thank you very much everyone for all of your feedback. All feedback is appreciated. That's the only way I can improve, you know. And let me know if it's any better, my audio. And without further ado, let's have a look at the G3000. This is the TBM, and I have the TBM version. There are two versions, and I'm gonna use the one that's only for the TBM. And this mod is not compatible with the Cessna Citation Longitude yet. It's mostly focused on the TBM 930, so keep that in mind. And when you download this, you're gonna have two packages, MSFS 2020-G3000-Enhanced-STD, which is the standard, and MSFS 2020-G3000-Enhanced-TBM. And uh, I am using the TBM version. The standard version will break the citation longitude. So if you don't have it, you can safely ignore that. I am using the TBM version because it comes with an extra feature for the TBM 930, which is, I think it's one of the most polished aircraft out of the gate. Like from all the aircraft Azobo gave us, I think this one is the most well polished. Okay, so now we can adjust the brightness of both the PFD and the MFD with the touchscreen selection we have here. And to do so, you go MFD, you have Aircraft Systems, Lightnings, Lightning Configuration, and this is what you're going to be using. And it's going to turn down or up both of these, so let me show you. This is the minus plus pretty self-explanatory and um, you can also drag this one on yeah see so now we can do this real nice back to pfd and we also have a bunch of new stuff especially it also works for the tiny map but i think this is the one we use the most when flying so we can change the map orientation which you do so on the MFD, and then you have map settings, map orientation, north up, track up, heading up. See, track up. You can have the 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 little map inset. It can be completely different than this one, or you can also sync them both. So track up, track up. As you can see, they are synced off. Heading up, heading up, and this one is track up, so they are not synced anymore. Let's go back to north up. You also have the airspaces, airports, VORs, and DBs. And toggling this on or off, it does change things. Settings for the airports, you know. Um, this is the distance where they start showing up, I think, I believe. And you can also toggle the roads. There's a map detail setting. And let, let's zoom out a little bit so you can see both screens. There we go. See, it starts clearing the map. And what we can also do now... So this is basically the range knob on the MFD for this map. We can also zoom out up until 1,000 nautic miles. See, 1,000 nautic miles. And now we can also toggle the next red for the PFD inset map. And to do so, you do PFD map settings and you have weather overlay. Bam. Let's, let's make it stormy, this way we can actually have a look at this. Um, storm. Bam. As you can see, it does work. We have the water overlay working. 
And let's have a look at this one. So you go MFD, water. See, it's working. Um, let's zoom out a little bit. Yeah, it's very, very stormy. Uh, let's clear the water now. Go back to clear skies. And this mod also fixes a vanilla bug, a bug that comes with the standard game, which basically the wind here, we don't have any wind right now, but it actually, it was actually pointing in the wrong direction, and now it should be pointing in the right direction. And uh, now, uh, this works on the TBM version only, which is the one we have. But the back lightning of the standby altimeter and airspeed indicator is controlled by the overhead panel lightning knob. This way every bit of light inside the TBM is adjustable. So that's really really nice, especially for those sweet sweet night time flying. And up here, this decreases, this increases. Let's see if we can zoom out enough where you can see both. Okay, um, so it's all the way down and this is pretty dim. Now we, we go back up and let's, oof. There we go, now it it's way brighter. So now we can do that. Again, I will include a link for this in my description down below. I hope you guys enjoyed. I know I did. I have flown the TBM a lot and I foresee flying this a lot more. And I'm, I really really like this mod since it's a, an aircraft that I actually enjoy flying and you can land pretty much anywhere with the TBM. Um, again, thank you very much everyone. I hope you enjoyed. If you did, make sure to leave a like and subscribe. I hope to see you all all again real soon and until then stay safe fly safe bye bye